I'm going to show you how to make this beautiful ring. Materials needed are 14 teardrop beads. These teardrop beads are measuring about 1.2 cm in length. And you can see that um, the holes is actually from the right to the left. And you will also need um, ring finding that look like this. So um, this is the ring cap and this is the ring base. So um, what we are going to do is we are going to place the chair drop bits on top here. And after we have finished it, we are going to uh, place it here. We are going to um, press this little um, thing here downward so that the, the ring cap can be positioned firmly on the ring. You will also need a, um, a nylon thread measuring about 80 cm in length. Okay. Um, to use our job, you need a needle. Place the needle on top of the nylon thread. Leave about 2 cm here. And at the end of the nylon thread, let's make a few knots. So this is to prevent the bits from falling off. So I'll make about three knots. All right. Let's prepare our big cap, uh, having the curvy part facing upward. String the first bit from the needle. Okay. I'm from the center. I'm going to um, name the the first lay the first round surrounding the center has the first layer and the second row has the second layer. I'm from the center. I'm going to work on the second row of the big cap. So let's. Put the needle into the bead cap, pull the string tightly and place it to the next bead hole. And from here, insert the needle back to the bead. In my first teardrop bead, just for the second teardrop bead. So place the second teardrop bead next to the first bead and insert your the needle onto the next nearest bead hole. Pull it to the back. Bring it back again from the back. I have about uh, 9 bits now surrounding the big cap. Let's put in the last bit. Okay, so I have 10 bits for the first layer. So now, um, we are moving to inward to um, put on the teardrop bits so um, let's let's just bring bring the nylon thread onto the second layer so I have just inserted the um, needle to through the second 
one of the hole from the second layer and my thread is at the back right now just bring it forward again now I'm ready to put on the first bit for the second layer okay um, similar method once I have my teardrop bit here I bring it to the nearest hole bring the needle to the back Bring it to the front again from another hole. Insert it back to the bead. Okay, repeat the same process for the rest of the beads for the second layer. Now I have placed three beads onto the second layer, so let's put on the last bead. Done with the ring. So now, um, just pass the needle to, to a few beads to tighten the position. Make a knot here. Pass the needle to a few more beads. before you cut off the excess thread. Once the beads are secured on the bead cap or the ring cap, tie a knot, cut off excess nylon thread. Now you can place this ring cap onto the ring base with the help of a flat nose plier press, press this little um, thing here towards the ring cap to secure the position.